Welcome back. In between the parts? Yeah, I did exactly what I said I was going to do. I got all these accessories. Even evergreens over here. Probably want some more in the future. But for now, it's, that's, that's fine by me, and I've still got quite a bit of money. And I do have... Where can I see it? Still quite a bit of sepit. It went quite well. And about what? Like 2.4, 2.5k sepith in order to make enough money. It took about three hours. It's fine though. Anyway, let's get on with the quest. Well, Lloyd, will you agree to guide Master Shin around Crossbell City? Sure, why not? Alright. We'll accept. So, we're in the city. Should we go specifically? I think Master Shin has a few places in mind. He'll let you know. Have fun, Master Shin. And do be careful on your tour. I don't need you to tell me that. Let's be off, my dearest Ellie. Oh, wait, Shin. Were you thinking of going on the tour alone with Ellie? There are far too many of you to travel comfortably. And besides, three is a crowd. I get that, but... He may be connected to Hayway, but I doubt anyone will try to target a child. Still, is it a good idea to leave them alone? <clears throat> Shin, it's almost time for the trade conference. Crossbell is on high alert right now, meaning that anything could happen. For the sake of your safety, wouldn't it be smarter to travel with more protection? You may have a point. Very well. Two of you may come of us, but no more. The others can watch us from a safe distance. How does that sound? Well, honestly, it's not too shabby of an idea. Actually, that's typically the practice when it comes to protecting high-profile individuals. And then it's decided. You should be in the front party too, Lloyd. Uh, which of us three do you want to come along with you? Let me think. Hmm. 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 Try to think like who'd be the most funny. It's like it's it's between Randy and Wazzy. Hmm. Let's go, Wazzy. Would you mind hanging along with us, Wazzy? I guess. I don't mind being your plus one for a little double date tour around the city. And in Noel, you two keep an eye on us from a distance and observe the surroundings. You got it. Roger that. Is this arrangement to your liking, Shin? I have no objections. And do not coddle me. I am old enough to look after myself, and Hayway's members do enough of that already. <laughs> sure, you got it, Shin. All right. Let's get going. I'll tell you where I'd like to go once we're outside. Did that door just close then? The door is sealed shut. I'm sure I saw it close. How fortunate it was for all of you to answer my request when you did. Do be sure to take good care of Master Shin for us. One thing I have to remind myself is that what do we actually have in terms of requests? Because it's like we're doing the rounds, I'm like, wait, where are we in this stuff? Because I want to get, obviously, the ones done here. So it's Old America Road Monster. So I think after we've done the rounds in the city, then, we'll head off to America via the roads. And then, seeing as we're so close, we'll then go off and do CGF training before then we go off and do the doctor's request. Obviously, we do this at the moment, but, you know... It's, 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 it's a plan. It's a plan. It, it makes, it makes sense. We've, we've already found the, well, we didn't find the, um, ancient Jedi text, did we? I wish you safe travels, Master Shun. Oh, how lovely. Just wondering if, like, anything changes up here with him in the group. Probably not, but you never know. Let me first explain the details of Tor. Make me repeat myself, so pay attention. Yeah? Sure? Damn brat, he's trying to act like a big shot in front of Madame Moiselli. I'm, I'm never gonna get used to that. Just just get used to the fact I'm not gonna get used to it, because it's just... It's a mouthful. Very strange. 
true, but he's sort of pulling it off. That love-struck fool really does like Ellie, doesn't he? Who, Lloyd? What was that? You have something to say to me? No, nope, it's nothing. We're ready to hear your explanation. Very well. Let me get straight to the point. As we discussed inside, you all will act as my tour guides around the city. However, trying to navigate this place without a goal would just be tiring. Therefore, there is one spot in particular I would like you to eventually take me to. No one in particular. I can think of two places that would be good end goals. One would be Orcus Tower. And the other one would actually be the rooftop, because then you could see everything, including Orcus Tower. Yes. Yeah, so I'd like to go to the roof, the Times Square, Bob, d d department store. Just, I got excited because I was right. In Central Square. Simply make sure you take me there last. After that, you will be relieved of your duties. You got it. That's easy to remember. So beyond that, are we free to pick where we go? No. Don't use that as an excuse to take me to boarding places between here and there. I'd like to arrive in Central Square via East Street. Okay... Is it me, or have you already planned most of this out? <laughs> Please, this is a special trip for me. So of course I've made preparations. Although, that is the extent of my plans. I'll be grateful if you can take us on a few enjoyable detours so that I may spend more time with Ellie. Don't forget that I'm one of the tour guides as well, Shin. Nonsense. Out of the question. You're now my guest, which means that you should enjoy yourself too, Ellie. <laughs> I think Lovestruck is right. That aside, I think I know what we're supposed to be doing now. Basically, just want to take the scenic route around the city. Does that sound fine, Shin? Wait. Have we got any other options to explore? What about Arkansas or something like that? There's always Mission and Wonderland. No, I think they're closed, and that's not in the city limits anyway. Who you take me for? Of course I've already been to the most notable places in Crossbell. They were enjoyable enough. I would not mind returning in the future, but that is not the call for today. There is much more I need to see of Crossbell before I leave. I'd rather see Crossbell City's true face, as its citizens know it, rather than the same tourist attractions. Okay, so avoid the entertainment district. Crossbell's true face. We put a lot of thought into this. Just imagine how pushy he's going to be once he grows up. The little shit. Do you understand now? We are burning daylight, so let's start the tour already. Understood? We're ready to go. Off we go. Be sure to watch our backs, you two. Roger. Not no. Keep your eyes peeled up there. But I don't have a peel around me. Yes, yeah, so we can't go to Michelin. Did we speak to you? Yes, we did. I remember the ad, darn it. Hmm. The IBC, yes. It is a fine building. Is this not your first time here, Shin? It is not. Even Hayway has an account with the IBC, naturally. It just so happens that I recently visited to open a personal account to use in stock trading. I'm hoping for some good dividends soon. Don't think of it. Weren't you doing something like that while you were a student, Ellie? Yes, I dabbled in trading a little bit for future reference. So you deal in stocks too, Ellie? Reminds me, I found something interesting to invest in. Not many people have taken notice of it yet, and it has promising aspects. I could always recommend you other stocks if you'd like. Other stocks? Maybe I shouldn't have mentioned that. Or like a fourth wheel. Forget about it. My apologies, Ellie. I simply got carried away because you and I shared something in common. <laughs> Don't apologize. You surprise me is all. Oh, Ellie, you really are like a goddess. Still, the IBC is hardly anything special, so we don't 
need to head inside. Let's move on to the next location. Sure. Where, though? Because I don't want to head towards the entertainment district or tourist spots, which I'm thinking very much... The... Let's look here. Oh. <laughs> I was going to use the map to be like, right, so th this is what we shall do. This is, like, the, the, the locations. Can't use that. The, um... Admin district, like, that's very tourist spotty, I would say. But you can oversee it from the, um... The rooftop, so we will see it. The only thing I'd say that is worth visiting is Orcus Tower, and you can't, right? Well, I can't, anyway. I still need to do the rounds here. But I'll save that for when we've done it. So, this is East Street. This is the first real chance I've had to soak it in. Do you feel at ease since it's reminiscent of home? I suppose so. No, this is nowhere near as lively as the Eastern Quarter. I'd love to show you around Calvary if I ever had the opportunity, my dear Ellie. You know, I'm thinking, let's just do the rounds. Like, because then we can, uh, assuming I can go to downtown, I could do the rounds there as well before we head off. Elsewhere, I'm trying to. Could go to the residential district. Hmm. You're more than welcome to come home with me. Uh, um, well, that's, uh, quite the offer. Straight to the point. You've got to respect the hustle. Alright, if it lets me. No. Hmm? Is this an apartment complex? Is there supposed to be something interesting inside of there? Well, not really. Then why bother tracking me there? There are other places you should be taking me. Alright, fine, we won't do the rounds. This is the crossbow branch of the Bracer Guild. Why are you hiding, Shin? Shut up! It's none of your business. My, oh my. What are you doing with that cute little boy there? Don't just stand there in the entrance. Come on over here. Okay. So, who's the rascal? He lost and looking for his parents? Not quite. Hey, 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 you! Is the Divine Blade of Wind here right now? Ah, uh, don't you have a mouth on you? Sorry, Dumpling, Arios is out at the moment. Uh, oh, good. What's with the relieved look? Hmm, his words, actions, and get a point me to one thing. I get it, you're connected with Hayway. I bet you're an Elder's grandson, too. How do you know that? I didn't know that, Cinny. You were the one who just told me. Still, you shouldn't let your guard down like that around me just because you think I'm dazzling. Sure. Why does he look to act like this? What a strange person. Are all people from the Brace Guild this way? You've been a rude little runt this entire time. I'm sure you make a fine member of the Mighty Heyway. Eh? I'm sure. It'll only become worse, too. For sure. That aside, why are you so obsessed with Arios? It's not like we hold a grudge against Heiwei or anything. So you say, you've meddled in the Elder's affairs many times. The Divine Blade of Wind and the Immovable. Mm-hmm. I've been nothing but problems for us. The Immovable? Ah, he means Zin the Immovable. A Calvardian A-rank bracer and a master of the Tato School of Ar Martial Arts. We don't see him often anymore. I know we don't. But he's helped this branch many times in the past. If I remember correctly, Nin also practices Tato, doesn't she? She sure does. Zin's one of her predecessors in the school, and it goes without saying that he's incredibly strong. You'd have to be... to cut it as a brace, huh? That may be, but the real problem with your guild is your honor code. Maybe it's your rule set or whatever. That doesn't give you the right to do whatever you want in the name of civilian safety. Don't you know? Our code balances itself out. And there are some things even we can't touch because of our non-interference pledge. But hold the phone, little man. How do you know so much about that at your age? Seriously, I'm impressed, <laughs> Flattery will get you nowhere. Anyway, you braces are... 
I think that's enough moaning about the gill. You're still just a kid after all. By the way, Kira and Shizuku are hanging out upstairs. I know, that's why I came here. We should go say hi to them. That's right, don't slipped my mind. That they're here. Why don't we introduce Shin to them? What? Who's that? Din, 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 din. Hi, guys! Good morning, everyone. Hey there, Kia. Looks like you two are having fun. It's been some time since we last met Shizuku. Mm-hmm, <laughs> you're right. Are all of you working right now? I guess you could say that, yeah. Who are these kids? Do you know them? Huh? Who's he? A little boy. <laughs> Who's little? I'm Shin. The man slated to bear the burden of Hayway's future as an elder's grandson. I apologize. Wow, well, you're so tiny, yet you're an adult like Lloyd. You're a lot greater than your size, let's on, huh? S stop it. Stop calling me small. Not even a distinguished legacy of Hayway is a match for Kia. Oh, Shin. These two are Kia and Shizuku. I think they're a little older than you. Did we mention that Shizuku is Arios' daughter? That's the Divine Blade of Winds. I bet you're a swordsman too, aren't you? Your eyes have been closed this entire time. I bet you're using that inside thingy. Inside? How do you know about inside? <laughs> no, of course not. Actually, I'm unable to see. My hearing is better than most because of it. But I'm not nearly as cool as my father. I'm terribly sorry. That was ungentlemanly of me. Please forgive me for my insolence. <laughs> it's okay. Wow. So he can be a good little boy when he wants to be. That was it? So you're Shin, huh? You're from out of town, right? How much longer are you going to be in Crossbell? I'll be here for about two more days, if you must know. Does that mean you're going to check out the Tower of Vaden tomorrow? We're gonna watch it from the Times rooftop. You want to join us? Uh, are you sure? Yeah, why not? Ryu and Anri and the other kids are all gonna be there too. It'll be plenty of fun. Y you don't say. Uh, well, if you're going to be that persistent, I have no choice but to take you up on the offer. The unveiling is tomorrow at 11 a.m., is it not? Yep. We'll see you there. That's pretty happy right now. Perhaps he doesn't have many opportunities to play with other children his age. You're a really nice boy, Shin. I have no earthly idea what you could mean by that. I am the man shouldering the burden of Heiwei's future. <laughs> I'll see you on Time's Rooftop at 11am tomorrow. I'll be waiting for you. Y yeah, sure. S see you tomorrow. Don't know about your circumstances, but I still think you're a nice boy, Shin. <laughs> I could never be me. I'm not the good boy she thinks I am. Oh my. He's a very good boy. Oh yeah, I started playing that Pom Party Orbital game the other day. You guys wanna have a go at it? Let's have ourselves a friendly little match if you're free. Oh! That feels like the normal rounds, doesn't it? Alright, let's check in here. Nope. This is an exclamation, it's not gonna let me in, is it? What is this place? It's the home of the Crossbell Business Owners Association's chairman. He's a good friend of ours. I see now. I suppose even Zhao and the others would pay their respects to the chairman of the Business Owners Association. It may be wise for me to go greet him. Was that a... Oh. I should check the fisherman's place then. Maybe. What's this? Some sort of fish store? No, this is the Imperial Fishing Club. Well, either way, it's somewhere for fishing enthusiasts and gatherers, is it? Their ilk exists in Crestman too, I see. There are people like that in Calvert? Oh, we're gonna have to go fishing in the Calvert games. Yes, we have our own clubs. Incidentally, my grandfather is obsessed with fishing, but I don't see what all the excitement is about. Let's use a net to catch fish. It's clearly the most effective method. Yeah. I'm willing to bet our fishermen friends would strongly disagree. Right, can't go in there. Okay. Oh, 
Oh dear, I see you've brought yet another adorable child with you today. Please excuse our unannounced intrusion, ma. Oh, aren't you one well-mannered child? You don't have to worry at all. Would you care for some tea? Oh no, I wouldn't want to overstay my welcome. The social etiquette is excellent. I don't even know how to respond. He knows how to play the part. <laughs> so you are well-mannered. If only our Roy would follow your example. Dim. Dim, 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 dim. Well, if it isn't Lloyd, to what do I owe the pleasure? The young man with you has quite the eastern attire. I take it he is not from around these parts. You're the chairman of the Business Owners Association, aren't you? I am Shin, a man burdened to carry the future of Hayway on his shoulders. Hayway, you say? They're the trading company based out of the eastern quarter that recently expanded into Crossbell. You said you're burdened to carry their future. Are you perhaps related to the Council of Elders? I am. My grandfather is one of the elders. Do you know the elders, Mr. Balls? Oh, no. I, I, I merely engaged in a few small exchanges back in my days as a trader. But I never personally met them. I have to say, it was smart of them to send their grandson over here. Though, why are you with Lloyd and his team? Well, one thing led to another. Huh? <laughs> These people were dying to show me the sights. How could I deny them their wish? <sighs> this kid is pure ego. <laughs> Sounds like there's more to it, but the important thing is that you all seem to be getting along well. She had her name was Shin. I'd be glad if you took a liking to Crossbell, young man. I'm happy to say I've been enjoying it. Now, if you'll excuse us. Can't say I ever expected the grandson of a Hayway elder to come here. It'd please me if you took an interest in our city. Let's check in here. I'm sure he'd like the food. Oh, can you just go straight in? Long Lao. So they even have Eastern style restaurants on East Street. Would you like to stop here for a break? A fine idea. I'm a little hungry, actually. I'd like to see exactly what kind of food is served here. So, was Long Lao to your liking? I also want to know your opinion, considering you've had authentic Eastern cooking. Hmm? Huh? What's the meaning of this? Why are they sending these items like this at such a price? Is the owner out of his mind? Calm down, Shin, if you complain so loudly. No, Jin is probably... For example, this Maypo tofu is better than anything I've had from the three-star restaurants in the Eastern Quarter. Something this exquisite should be three times more expensive, so why isn't it? <laughs> That's what got you all riled up. I don't believe this. Why is a restaurant of this quality hiding in Crossbell? <laughs> well, either way, I'm glad you enjoyed yourself. Sounds like we're done here, then. Let's try... Is that Bond? That's Bond, isn't it? But it's Detective... Oh, the SSS! As you can see, I'm patrolling the marketplace. Keep the good work you do for all the citizens. Yeah, very well. Ah, I'm stuck! Damn walls, just appearing out of nowhere. Walls appeared! Just what is this place? It's so dreary. This is the downtown jurisdiction. Sadly, it's what was left behind during the city's redevelopment years ago. I see. I suppose every country has these sorts of places. I've seen enough. Let us return to East Street. It, yeah, okay. Oh. Well, I was going to speak to Reese, but okay. Let's... Go back. Bim, 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 bim. This would be Central Square, correct? It's about as busy as I'd expect a sort of fair to be. That's right, the town's department store you mentioned earlier is nearby too. Could we get him a balloon? Should we head there right now? 
I'll let the three of you figure that out. I'm just happy I get to be by Ellie's side like this. That much is clear. You're so sweet, Shin. Why don't we ever look around before ending our little tour? Hey there, little boy! Want a balloon? They gently float in the air and are a ton of fun to play with. No thanks. It'll only get in my way. Okay, what color would you- Wait, what did you say? It'll get in your way. Something tells me Shin hates being treated like a kid. Well, now I'm gonna go to places that treat him like a kid, aren't I? Sure, not every kid out there loves balloons, but I didn't expect to get so coldly rejected. It's kind of depressing. Oh, horse, mate. Let's check the station. Huh. Is this the department store that way? No, this leads to Station Street. There's your answer. Let's turn back. Sure. Sorry about that. Let's try going residential, then. West Street is just up ahead. Probably shouldn't go too far away from the department store now. Let's turn back. Okay. Let's check the stores. I figured Saltier would go to a chef hard than this. We've already had that. Hmm. Maybe not there then. Let's check the weapon shop. Grande Armory. This is a legal weapon shop, correct? Let's go inside for a bit. While it is true it's on the up and up, it's still an armory like you said, Shin. With all the dangerous weapons inside, there's no way we can take you in. Hmm. As long as I don't touch them, I'm fine, right? I'm interested in it, so if I say we're going in, we're going in. Yeah, I'll let you handle this one, Ellie. Leave it to me, Lloyd. Listen, Shin. You're one of the most important people we've ever had the pleasure of escorting. That's why we simply can't take any threat to your safety lightly. You're smart, Shin. I'm sure you'll understand our circumstances, right? Hmm, you make a compelling case. I'm glad you understand. I knew your wisdom would shine through in the end. Yes, you're right, I am wise. He has it wrapped around her finger. Alright, okay, fair enough. What's with the huge dog? Ah, oh, that's exactly who I was trying to introduce. What are you doing here, Zite? Maybe he just wanted a breath of fresh air. Scared to death. Is something wrong, Shin? Was it Zite that finally rattled your cage? What are you talking about? Absolutely not. Nothing scares me. That said, this dog bores me. Let's go to the next spot. Sure. He's only pretending to be courageous, but you have to admire his gusto. Okay, can't go to the SSS building. So, this is the orbital store that's always in those magazines, hmm? I like how it looks in here. They seem to be offering the latest appliances, at least. I don't think anything in Calvert matches up in terms of scale, either. I mean, it's very much like Crossbow to carry a wide variety of goods from multiple nations. Speaking of cutting edge, over there is what's called an Orbital Network Terminal. Orbital Network, you said? Yeah, to keep things simple, it's essentially an advanced communications device. The Orbital Network project is steadily progressing through the work at the Epstein Foundation. Wait, I mean, if I can't go to the residential, like West Street, if I can't go to West Street, I wanted to show him the car, but alright. Because I have upgraded it. By using a terminal, not only can you transmit your voice, but even text and pictures too. And for that one comment down in the comments, I did get the spoiler so Randy doesn't die now. We're all good there, don't you worry. Wow, this kind of technology insists. Hm. Not that I'm surprised. What are you, an encyclopedia? Quit trying to show off. No, I'm not trying to show off. What a competitive little runt. Also, I would like to thank people in, like, the discussions we had down in the comments trying to figure out roughly where, like, um, Class 7 is right now. Group A should either be, like, travelling to or be in the castle at Le Grand. And why I, I was trying to figure that out and why it was so important is, like, because there is a certain Lance Maiden there that I know, based on my knowledge from all around the place, like, she's part of this game as well, so it's like, okay, she, if she's there, how, how does her timing line up and stuff like that, so it's like, 
That's why I was trying to figure it out, mainly. So it's sort of like, okay, they're about to run into her. That's what's happening right now. Ish. Like, the precise timing, like, we don't know because it's we're doing the rounds. This could be the same hour, it could be middle of the day. J don't know at this point. Well, here we are. Times department store. Anyone else you'd like to take Shin first? I don't think we'll have time to show him around once we've entered. The decision is yours. Either way, try to make it quick. I'm going to double check, because this feels like DP significant. Well, I'm glad I checked, because I was going to go straight to the roof. Enter the department store. I think we've shown him around enough already, so let's enter. Very well, I'm looking forward to what's inside. Then let's not keep you waiting. Now they've entered the store. Is something the matter, Randy? Yeah, I thought I felt something while we were attaining them. You did? You think it's someone from Hayway? That'd be my first guess. To be honest, I'm not sure. Anyway, we should probably head inside in a bit, too. Right, understood. Why don't we check out a few of the shops before we head to the roof? Anyway, I'll lead the way. Yeah, because the one, the one thing that was pointed out in this was very much like, go to these. I would have completely skipped past these and either gone and checked the stores or gone to the roof straight away. Are these the fabled Mishy plushies? Why are they here? We're not at Mishlim. This general store recently added a corner exclusive for Mishy merchandise. Are you a fan of Mishy's, Shun? Don't mock me. How could the man fated to lead Hayway be interested in these childish toys? Have you any common sense? Shin? You need to take it personally. No kidding, I doubt Hayway has rules that say the elders can't also be Mishy fans. Huh. Anyway. What's this? Item exclusive to Times, the TikTok Mishy? Yeah. Like I said, only children would take an interest in these things. I don't care for it one bit, not at all. He's not fooling anyone. He thinks a certain Hayway elder's grandson doth protest too much. Doth, you say? Lloyd spoke to Southwalk with a whisper. Excuse me, how much for the TikTok mystery? Oh, that'll be 500 Mira. <laughs> Getting a present for the kid? Yeah, I'm thinking about it. It's only 500 Mira. Should I buy it for Shin? Yes. Yeah, one TikTok Mishi, please. No problem. Thank you, and come again. Hey, you've been whispering for a while. About that. This is for you, actually. Lloyd handed the TikTok Mishi over to Shin. This is the store's limited edition. So that's what you were doing. What do I always say? He's got the biggest heart in all of Crossbell. What the heck? Are you giving this to me? It's a gift, Shin. You should take it. Give it as a token to remember this day by. To remember today. Well, you've already purchased it, so it's not like I could throw it away. I'll take it. However, let me make one thing clear. I am not interested in plushies. Got it. Yeah, whatever you say. Dim, 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 Such lovely music. I'm butchering it, but it's lovely. The department store's rooftop has quite the view, doesn't it? It's breathtaking, isn't it? You can get a full view of the city from here. It's managed to exceed my expectations. All right, Orcus Tower. Is that it over there? It's a little covered up, but seeing it tower over the city is amazing. Come on, Ellie. Get over here, close to me. <laughs> okay, okay. Oh, please be careful, you guys. I don't want anyone falling over the rail. So 
So, were you satisfied with the view from the roof? Yes, it's satisfactory. The rest of the city tour was too shabby, Ivor. I think today will be one to remember. I see. I'm glad you feel that way. I plan to return to Calvert two days from now. I'll once again be surrounded by stuffy adults forced to enjoy an endless torrent of studying. Such is the fate of a man who will one day command others. Shin? Sounds rough. By the way, Shin, are you enrolled in Sunday school? Yes, as a means of broadening my horizons. Everyone fears the adults that guard me, so they don't dare to approach me, though. That's why Kira and Shizuku, I believe. Uh, it was quite a fun experience to be able to talk to people my age. You'll know say. Good thing we talked to them, then. Pardon me, I'm not one to usually engage in useless small talk. At any rate, I've had an enough of a tour. Escort me back to the office at once. Roger. No, you should know better. It pleases me to know you enjoyed yourself. I'll admit that it exceeded my expectations. It would seem there is more to Crossbell than I can see in the theme park. Now I understand why a shrewd businessman like yourself is so tickled by a chow. Chow, even. You flatter me, Master Shin. Thank you, Lloyd, Ellie, and the rest of the SSS. I never could have imagined that a simple tour would please Master Shin so much. I am in your debt. Don't mention it, Zhao. We had a fun time as well. At the very least, we'd like for you to have this. It may not be much, but please accept it. Don't know if there's if that's such a good idea. We are all members of the CPD, after all. Hm. I thought you might say that, which is why I refrained from having Mira arranged for you. Consider this a token of friendship with Master Shin, or with me, if you would like. What? Well, how thoughtful of you, Zhao. Don't be shy, go on. Take it. Someone's pushy. I don't think we can say no if they're this insistent. Right. Well, okay, as long as it's not Mira. It would be our pleasure. Ooh. I think we should be going now. We'll see you around, Shin. <laughs> Until next time. I'll be looking forward to it, Ellie. The love of my life. You must have tired yourself out walking around the city like that. Pastries have been prepared for you in your private quarters. Is that so? That was thoughtful. Very well, I'll let Grandfather know how well you will all take care of me. He's adorable, isn't he? He's still young, but you noticed before they left, didn't you? A glimpse of his wisdom and talent. Can't wait to see how useful he will prove in the future. Right. Still, was that the safe decision to make? In the unlikely event that he had chosen to target Master Shin, he would have been the one held responsible, Master Zhao. Had that been the case, it simply would have been part of our shared destiny. However, they know just as well as I do that it's far too early for them to be making their move. Speaking of which, have we learned anything new? Yes, we caught wind of two targets that were taining Master Shin and the others. We're currently observing their movements. Excellent. Please allow them to proceed as they like. Take care that they don't notice us. And do be careful to see that our crimson neighbors don't interfere. Of course. I like that. It's like, it's such a nice little hidden side quest. I assume it was hidden and not part of a list or something. But it's that sense of like, we but I had a nice little tour. We got to learn more about Hayway, but there is more still going on. Which is just, it's, 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 it's so Falcon. But anyway, we'll end this part here and carry on the rounds in the next part. Ta-da for now!